I'm Jody Olson from the American Society of Plastic Surgeons, and this is your Plastic Surgery Update. Have you heard about those sweet deals on holiday trips abroad that include cheap plastic surgery? A lot of Americans in search of R&R and a new look travel to warmer countries for a little of both, completely unaware of the risks. It's called medical tourism and the American Society of Plastic Surgeons cautions consumers to do their homework long before they pack their bags this holiday season. The ASPS says that while there are qualified plastic surgeons abroad, consumers need to be aware not all practitioners, products and devices meet stringent U.S. standards. Infections are the most common complication seen in patients who travel for plastic surgery and fixing complications can be far more costly than perceived savings of bargain shopping abroad. Check out the ASPS Find a Surgeon tool to search for qualified plastic surgeons in the U.S. and around the world. It's at PlasticSurgery.org. We all know that gravity never lets up, but apparently it's no match for most facelifts. In fact, new research shows that facelifts are indeed long-lasting. It's in the current issue of Plastic and Reconstructive Surgery, the official scientific journal of the American Society of Plastic Surgeons. The study found three-fourths of patients still look younger than they did before surgery, up to five years after they had the procedure. Also from PRS, the increasing number of Indian Americans having cosmetic nose surgery. Researchers believe the surge in nose procedures may have been influenced by the beauty standards shown in Indian films, also known as Bollywood movies. Although the Indian Americans in the study wanted to change their appearance, none wanted to remove their Indian ethnicity. Most of the ones that I've done have been people who have more of a hump and what they perceive as a little bit larger nose and they just want it refined and less noticeable. And but. I also am one of those people, and I totally agree with the article, that you don't want to lose your ethnicity. You don't want, I mean, you don't want everybody to have that small, teeny, tiny, upturned nose. <laughs> that would not look good. Overall statistics show that nearly a quarter of a million people had cosmetic nose surgery in the U.S. last year. For more information on these stories and other trends in plastic surgery, go to PlasticSurgery.org. And remember, for any cosmetic or reconstructive procedure, make sure your surgeon carries the ASPS symbol of excellence, an assurance of the highest standards, the American Society of Plastic Surgeons.